Hey friends, what's up? Kaz here. Welcome to the chat and messaging formatting of Essentials X. This is such a great and big plugin. I want to make sure that I dive into each section of it to really help you guys get up and going. This is another, this is a big part of it that everybody asks me about. So when you start typing, you're going to see my username is red. It has the carrots around it and then the message of that. And then when you look at the tab list, all that stuff is not in there. We give myself a prefix of hi, you're going to see that it will not, or it does show up there right at the beginning because of the display name is set, but we would want to set something like, and then put a space after it and probably like the, that around it. And then uh, now you can see that we have that, but we still have those carrots around your whole username. So we really want to kind of mess with that stuff and make that look a little bit better. So first off, there is some permission nodes uh, associated with this to message another user. You're going to go message uh, and then just say hi. So then he gets that message and he can actually do slash R and then reply back. And if he has access to that command, what we can do our howdy. We can also send um, color codes, all that stuff. If you need, first of all, you need the permission note essentials.message or msg, and then essentials.message.color.magic.format.url.multiple so that you can do all of that stuff. And then if you want to do mail, send evil howdy. So we sent him a message. He's going to see that notification. He can read it by doing mail. If you just do mail read oops but we do not have any mail so then uh, you can also do that would require essentials.mail and then essentials.mail.send in order to send mail and then essentials.mail.send all in order to send messages to all so you're going to do mail send all hi and then i'll send it to all players on on your server so that is uh, private messaging and mail. So let's go ahead and get loop around and make sure that we can get our uh, tablets to show up correctly as well as change the way that um, our names look. Okay, so jumping right back into the configuration, a couple things up at the top. Like I said in the last tutorial, you want to change this to zero if you don't want to change the color code to red. And then you want to change that for prefixes as well as if you're not using the Essentials Chat, you're going to want to um, change some of this stuff, but we want to change the player list. And then um, we don't want it to add the prefix and suffix. We want Essentials Chat to be able to do that. And, but we do want to add the prefix in the player list and the suffix in the player list. And then we're going to keep scrolling all the way down to the, the chat section, which is down here towards the bottom. Here we go. So this is where you can change what it looks like overall so we have display message we're going to remove those carrots and then you can actually change the color code as well i think seven is gray you can also use group as well as a few other options like world name um uh, that kind of stuff but i would recommend just leaving display name message let your permissions plugin handle all the prefix and suffix basically the display name is going to grab the prefix username and suffix and put it all in one so you want to do all your color formatting in the prefix and then the suffix so if you want their username to change colors based upon the prefix you can the last character of your prefix can be a color code and will change the color code of the user because Minecraft reads it left to right. So then you would also want to change it back with your suffix in, so or otherwise the message will get changed as well. So we didn't do too much with changing that, but you need that essentials chat dot jar um, for this to work. So let's go ahead and reload. We went ahead and reloaded. Now you can see that uh, that those carrots are gone around our, our name. Um, the color of the, the message is like a light gray. And then you can see our prefix shows up in the player list. Like I said, it's pretty straightforward, but if you're missing that essentials chat in there, or you don't set up your prefixes or suffix right in your uh, permissions plugin, which I'd highly recommend PEX. I have a tutorial on that. Link will be in the gibbles. Um, you'll be have trouble getting up and running. So. Hopefully that gets you going. Guys, this is Kaz reminding you guys all. Enjoy the game. God bless. Uh -oh.